Sri Lanka, Pearl of the Indian Ocean. It is an island with roughly 1,300 kilometers of coastline. Inside the country there are rivers, estuaries, streams, natural lakes and man-made reservoirs. Hence its waters have become a haven for both commercial fishermen and anglers. Today we explore the world of sports fishing, also known as angling. In Sri Lanka, sports fishing has been around since colonial times. The Ceylon Sea Anglers Club, established in 1934, is the oldest recreational angling club in the country. Although at a glance there seems to be no difference between traditional fishing and angling, in reality both have different purposes and methods. So traditional fishing methods were used in Sri Lanka for a long time. Things like netting, in boating and also like trap methods and uh, if you go back in time I think even harpooning. So it has been there and even with bow and arrow I think our Vedda people would have done the same thing in the history. So that's into the, the traditional form of fishing. But when it comes to sport fishing or angling, angling is a different form of uh, act altogether because you use a reel, rod, hooks or lures, uh, those are baits. So this is to, you know, fight a fish or to win one. So this doesn't, you know, here wh what you're doing is, you know, you're, you're fighting a fish and you're trying to win that fellow. So doing that, it, it falls into a category of sports. To the untrained eye, angling may seem like child's play. In fact, there are different techniques demanding proficiency which anglers use to catch fish. In angling, there are various methods of angling where you use uh, different reels, different rods and uh, different places and different techniques uh, where you use to catch a fish for a, sport, a sports purpose. So the first we have a, a thing called a fly fishing technique where you use a fly fishing reel and also then there's this uh, beach casting or surf casting. Surf casting and beach casting you have different reels. You have overhead uh, casters which I was using here in the estuary and there are spinners and uh, then it goes into another section called trolling. Trolling is a form of uh, sport where you have rods and rails fixed onto a boat and then you uh, have the lures following the boat where you can, you know, the anglers will be seated or you know, they will be inside the boat till a fish strikes this bait. Unfortunately, sports fishing in Sri Lanka is adversely affected by a variety of factors, some of which include pollution, overfishing and even dynamiting. But angling is a universal sport and Sri Lanka has become a hot spot for tourists who want to fish in exotic locations. Hence angling is more than a personal hobby. It is also a profitable venture offering incentives that bring in much revenue to the country.